Hello all and welcome back again. Today we are going to create this tricky infographic design. Let's get started. As usual, let's first enable the guides and then format our background. Select fill type as solid and change the fill color to dark blue color. Now go to insert tab and draw rounded rectangle. Adjust its roundness using yellow color edit point as shown and make it no outline. Right click on the shape and choose format shape. Increase its transparency value so that we can see through the shape. Duplicate this shape using Ctrl plus D and arrange both shapes as shown. Change fill color of duplicate shape to any brighter color. Just for clear visibility. Now go to insert tab and draw rectangle shape. Again change its solid fill to any brighter color and rotate this shape by 5 degrees. Increase its transparency to see through. Now this is bit important. Adjust the rectangle using arrow keys exactly to the point where corner roundness of blue color rectangle ends. Now align yellow color rectangle with red color rectangle. Both must slightly touch each other. Subtract red color rectangle with blue color rectangle shape. Now draw another rectangle shape and remove the extra projection of blue rectangle that you see at top right corner. Subtract both rectangles to remove that extra shape. Now union both blue and yellow color rectangles to get our final design shape. Remove the transparency as it is not required now. Adjust the shape size as per your requirement. Now go to Insert tab and draw triangle shape. Make it no outline and flip it vertical. Align it with first shape as shown and union them both. Now draw another rounded rectangle and align it with first shape as shown. Send it back, make it no outline and fill it with light gray color. Align and adjust both shapes as shown. Adjust the corner roundness of white rectangle shape as well. Now duplicate these both shapes three more times. Make use of shortcut key, Ctrl plus D. Let's apply linear gradient to top rectangle shape. Change the gradient direction to vertical right and make it a two-step gradient. Change the gradient step colors using color palettes. 
Each set of colors in this palette are different shades of same color. Now double click on Format Painter and apply same gradient pattern to other shapes. Let's quickly change the colors using color palettes. Now select bottom 4 rectangle shapes and apply reflection effect as shown. Reduce the reflection size and increase its blurness. That looks better. Finally add PNG icons and text fields to finalize our design. Let's speed up to save time. So here is the final preview. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment.